I'm going to show you how cross hatching works. Let's figure out which one of these gray cells contains the seven. First thing you want to notice is that the one, two, and nine are coming down column four. So the one, two, and nine can only be in three places here in block eight. Now by using cross hatching, we look across rows nine and eight to see that a seven is already in those two rows. So the only place left for a seven in block eight is right here which means we can eliminate a seven from this gray cell and leaves only one other cell in block two that contains a seven. 